everyone knows all about different dog breeds. Dogs are much more associated with individual breeds than cats are. However, there are dozens of different breeds of cats, and each breed is different from one another just like dogs. So how do you know what cat breed is right for you? You need to consider what you want out of a cat and your personal household before making a decision. Evaluate your living situation. The first thing you should do before settling on a cat breed is to evaluate your personal living situation. How many people are in the house? Are kids or other pets involved? Do you have room for a litter box? Do you spend a lot of time at home or a lot of time on the road? These questions are imperative. Some cat breeds are better with kids and pets than others. Some cat breeds are perfectly fine being left alone for hours or days at a time, while others are not. Large breed cats might feel cramped or obnoxious in a small apartment. Outdoor or indoor or both? Do you want an indoor cat or an outdoor cat? Indoor cats are very common, but they run the risk of running away or being scared of strangers or other cats if left isolated inside for too long. Outdoor cats are fun, but they have the risk of disappearing and not coming home, and you have to be prepared for that. Do you have property where a cat can safely roam nearby the house without disturbing the neighbors and the local wildlife? Outdoor cats also run the risk of getting parasites or getting into fights with other cats, which you will have to factor into your plan for medical treatment. Some cats are happy being let outside every once in a while but are also content to spend most of their time inside, which might be a happy middle ground. Size and appearance. The next thing you want to consider is how you want your cat to look. Do you enjoy large cats with a lot of weight or lean and petite cats? Some cats are extremely large, like Maine Coon cats which can weigh up to 10 pounds or more. Other popular breeds, like Siamese cats, are much smaller. Large cats eat more, produce more waste, and if they have long hair, they shed more. But large cats do have a striking appearance that appeals to many. Consider a cat's shedding. Speaking of shedding, cats shed a lot of hair. If you are allergic to cats or hate dust, you will definitely want to consider short hair cat breeds. There are short hair breeds and long hair breeds. Long haired cats have much thicker and longer fur. When these cats shed, they produce a higher volume of loose hair and, therefore, more allergies and associated particles. If you want a long-haired cat, you should check to make sure no one in your household has allergies related to cats. You will also have to consider grooming. Even though they keep themselves well-groomed, long-haired cats have the possibility of needing extra grooming due to their coats. Spend time with cats to gain some experience. If you don't really know how different cats act and behave, you should try and spend some time with cats to get more familiar with the species. There are various ways to do this. You can go to the local shelter and talk to the people there. Most shelters are more than happy to let you see the animals and spend time with them to see if you are a good fit. You can visit cat cafes. These new businesses allow you to sip coffee and play with cats. You can also ask your friends and family about their cats to see what they like or dislike about their particular cat. The more you know, the better informed you will be to make a decision that is right for you. Some cats are more independent than others. Some cats are very independent and can be left alone if you do not want to deal with them. Outdoor cats are very independent. Other breeds that are independent are British Shorthair, American Wirehair, and Persian cats. These cats can be left alone and will leave you alone if you work from home or are busy with children. Other cats, like Siamese cats, will need you to pet them, sit with them, and pay attention to them a lot more often. Needy cats that do not get enough stimulation can become a nuisance as they will bother you, meow and sit on you when you don't particularly want them to. Playful versus chill. Some cats are extremely playful and energetic. These cats will need a lot of play time or a lot of appropriate stimulation. Energetic and playful cats will need teasers, cat trees, and plenty of exercises. If playful cats do not get the proper stimulation, they can take it out by shredding your furniture and your shoes or even trying to play with you while you sleep. Energetic breeds include cats like Abyssinians, Bengals, and Savannah cats. Chill cats will be more content to nap the day away than play. Chill cats include Persians, Siberians, and Russian blue cats. Pick a cat breed that will fit your living situation and your personal preferences and energy levels. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.